What's going on YouTube? This is Stacy with Sand Trans LLC. And once again, I'm back on the channel. And here at Sand Trans, our motto is we are driving for financial freedom. And uh, I just want to stop in real quick and talk to you guys. Um, give you guys an update of maybe about a few weeks ago, I posted a video on um, a house that we had under contract and uh, that we were uh, we were selling and it was a it was a video about uh, investing your hot shot dollars you can go back and take a look at some of our other videos but um, I'm happy to say that that house has been sold uh, we closed on the property um, it was a long process as far as uh, getting it sold, uh, it took us a little longer than we thought. You know, it stayed on the market, but we hung in there. Um, matter of fact, the house had three contracts on it, and two of them fell through. So, uh, on this third contract, it was a success. So, I'm, I ha I'm happy to say uh, we closed, and um, you know, the uh, funds that we make from from that house we're going to be re reinvesting it we're not sure um where we're going to reinvest it at right now but um i had someone ask me uh when will i add another truck to sand trans and i thought about it and i answered it was a female who asked me the, the question and I said, well, I'm not really sure, but the first thing that comes to mind, you know, is supply and demand. And so uh, for me, if I had a driver and uh, I, would, I would consider it, the, the demand right now is up on, as far as freight. I think I could, I could manage an additional truck you know, from the experience that I, I have right now working on the load boards, but a lot of it depends on the driver. Uh, the driver plays a, a big part, would, would play a big part in me uh, adding another truck to our fleet. Well, I can't even say it's a fleet yet because we only have one, but um, so to, to answer that question, for me, it would depend on the driver, you know, the driver would, would would have to really mimic the driver uh, Adolf that we have right now. Um, you know, be just as good, just as good, or even better. You know, in order for me to pull the trigger. You know, um, that's a key part. If you guys don't know, uh, in this trucking industry, because the freight can't get there without the driver. You know, the truck is important also, but the truck do doesn't drive itself. So that would be a key part. I think it would be a lot easier uh, adding the truck now because we went through all the bumps and the bruises, um, went through the learning curve. So uh, if we have the right driver, you know, we could just plug him in to our system, and uh, he can keep trucking just from just from day one. You know, we he can come aboard. We can have the truck get it inspected, um, do all the uh, get all the the, uh, the IFTA stickers get the uh the new york hut sticker um just do everything with the truck and the trailer make sure everything is you know right and tight and if if the driver's ready he can jump in that truck on the first day especially if he's experienced and uh i mean he can run you know just based off of what we know right now from sand trans so uh to answer that question is uh driver driver you know but right now I'm not looking for any drivers you know because we just kind of cruising along you know cutting our teeth but if something was to just fall in our lap and if it's a good deal and it's a, if it's a good investment then now we act on the investment dollars that we have stashed away you know we we try to make wise moves with our money when we have them so you know, if that opportunity came up and it's a, it seems like it's a great investment, 
you know we've allocated dollars to, to pull the trigger and uh, I guess that's a lesson in itself where uh, you know when you guys stack your money up real tall like pancakes you know what I mean don't be so quick to just go out and invest in anything make sure you do your due diligence you study the, vet, the investment it has to feel right because sometimes the gut check is the best check you know um, but the data and the due diligence and the numbers they don't lie so you can research it good first and then um, pull the trigger and put your money to work so I, I hope that answered the question whether or not we would, would add another truck um, you guys hit me with your questions I think I could pretty much answer most of your questions now with the experience that I have um, if not, I'll, I'll research it and, and find out. So uh, hit me with your questions. Also, we're trying to grow the channel. So um, I'd appreciate, you know, if you like what I'm talking about, if you like what I'm saying, you know, hit the like button. You know, hit the like button. Show me show me some love. Um, I put a lot of effort and, uh, you know, I try to bring good content. So let me know what you think about the content. And uh, also, if you have questions, <laughs> Uh, hit me with the questions. You know, like I said, I'm, I'm gonna try to answer them. Uh, this is Sand Trans LLC. I want to thank all of our uh, 500 subscribers so far. Um, it really feels good, man. You know, and uh, we're trying to uh, increase the subscription up to a thousand before the end of the year. And I, I know we can do it with the help from you guys. So um, definitely like the channel, subscribe, Sand Trans LLC, driving for financial freedom as always. I'm out.